Ah! I'm screaming because I have my leaving cert exams. Yeah. Hello everyone, my name is Big Blue and welcome back to Big Blue's Banter where today I'm here in Molly. <laughs> today it is Thursday the 9th of June 2022 and it's currently about 6pm. And because it's the month of June, and because I'm in my last year of secondary school, I have a wonderful thing called the Leaving Cert. Now if you guys aren't familiar with the Leaving Cert or don't know what it is, like if you live outside of Ireland or something, it's basically a group of exams you do in each subject at the end of your last year of secondary school. And they are not fun. And they go on through the month of June. It always starts on like the second Wednesday of June. So this year's from the 8th of June until the 28th of June. Depending on how well you get on in your exams, you get a certain number of points. And the more points you have, the better chance you have of getting the place you want at college. So yeah, no pressure or anything, but these exams kind of decide my future. So it is currently Thursday, it's day two of the Leaving Cert. I have two of my 10 exams done so far. I have English paper one and English paper two done out of the way. Um, it's about an hour after I've just done English paper two, by the way, and it went well actually, all good so far, but that's only English. And tomorrow I have two exams. I have geography in the morning and then maths in the afternoon. <laughs> not a good combination to have on the one day and these exams are like super long as well like English paper 2 was three and a half hours long like my hand is completely like all blue like can you even see that like it's just completely all blue because I've been writing a blue pen for the last like three hours so yeah I decided to do a vlog of my remaining exams for the leaving so so you really get to see like the like the real fun starts now you know with geography and maths and stuff so I hope if you're a fellow leaving cert student or if you um, or taking the leave and so in the future then you find this video somewhat relatable or even if you have no idea what the leaving so is at all then I hope you still enjoy this video because there's still a bunch of stuff happening this month that I'm gonna cover like I'm gonna stream on YouTube and I'll do some behind the scenes on that and then I'm going to have my 19th birthday look at this face this face is nearly 19 years old right now by the time you're watching this video, this face will be 19 years old. So yeah, I'm gonna go up to my house, I'm gonna do some study for geography and maths tomorrow, and I'll see you guys then. It's currently 8.34 a.m. I have to be in for geography at 9.30 So yeah guys, I am going in for geography in a few minutes and um, after geography I'm going to go through, um, well after geography and maths today I'm going to go through each exam and just kind of tell you what um, was in each exam so you can get a taste for what I'm actually doing or maybe if you're a future leaving so student you get a taste of what the exams are actually like But for now, let's go do some geography So now I am back from my geography exam and it actually went really well. I was really happy with it It's about 1 p.m. Now and um, My max paper one exam is in about an hour So I'm just looking over some last-minute things just to remind myself of what's coming up in the paper But yeah geography went well, but for now Gotta look over some quick maths paper one stuff. So I'll go in now for my maths paper one And I'll see you guys on the other side Hello everyone. My hair is a mess. It is currently Monday and um, I just didn't have really like a lot of time to myself to just actually sit down and talk about the exams in depth over the weekend because like I was studying and other things were going on as well and I just don't want to like half do it for you so I don't want to feel this vlog is like too rushed either so I'm going to update you guys on the plan for this week. I have exams every day this week, so today, Monday, and then Tuesday, Wednesday, and uh, Friday. I actually don't have exams on Thursday. And the exam on Friday, the 17th of June, is German, and that's my second last exam. Then I don't have an exam then for about 11 days until the 28th of June, at which point I have politics. 
So uh, the plan is I'm going to get to the end of this week, going to get to my German exam on Friday, then I'm going to sit down and talk to you guys about the exams that have been going on so far and um, I think that's the plan. So I, I actually have a bit of time just to actually sit down and do that for you guys. I'm confident like not to show my like school badge on the video <laughs> which is why I'm holding the camera at like a sort of like awkward angle sometimes. I don't know if like my school want to be associated with me. I made that sound really bad oh my god. <laughs> I guess privacy, I guess. But yeah, guys, today's probably the worst day for exams. I have maths paper two and I have Irish paper one. I'm not the most confident in Irish, but um, hopefully it'll be okay. Also, maths paper one on last Friday went really good. So yeah, um, that scared me up well for maths paper two. So it's time to go in for some maths paper two, guys. Paper 2 went very well. I'm going in now for Irish Paper 1. I'll chat to you then. Hello everyone. So now it is about 6 p.m. I am done now. Maths Paper 2 and Irish Paper 1. I was actually quite nervous for Irish Paper 1, not gonna lie, but um, I'm so happy it's over now. Um, I actually am pretty confident, and so that's a very good um, optimistic sign. And I have Irish Paper 2 in the morning, so um, yeah, I'm not sure how that one's gonna go, but... Well, yeah, so far so good. And look, Molly's here. Hello Molly. Molly wants to say hello. Hi. As you guys can see here, it is currently Monday the 13th. I had maths paper 2 from 9.30 to 12. And I just had Irish paper 1 from 2 to 4.20. Tomorrow, Tuesday the 14th, I have Irish paper 2 from 9.30 to 12.35. And I have history on Wednesday then from 2 to 4.50. And then on Friday, I have German from 9.30 to 12.50. And then I have a break of 11 days and I go all the way down to Tuesday the 28th when I have politics from 9.30 to 12. So yeah guys, as I said, I will be talking about the exams after they end on Friday. Well, the second last exam ends on Friday and then I have an 11 day break as I just said. But um, yeah, that's the plan for this week anyway. And then next week is going to be my birthday and stuff. So super, super exciting stuff happening in this vlog, guys. And there could be a Nintendo Direct during this vlog. There is some rumours of a Nintendo Direct happening on the 15th of June. By the time you see this, you will know if that's happened or not. But I just heard that it could be the 29th of June, which would be awful. But yeah, I'm hoping to get this vlog out on the 28th of June because that's like the end of the Leaving Cert. It's all symbolic and everything. By the way, guys, are you doing the Leaving Cert or are you doing the Leaving Cert next year or something? Oh, there goes Molly. Molly does not want to be in the vlog anymore. Bye. <laughs> oh, she's here. Hi, Molly. Anyway, <laughs> are you guys doing the Leaving Cert or next year or something? Just let me know in the comments below and I'll try to respond to any feedback or questions I get. So yeah, all good so far. Um, for any of you wondering, I'm doing higher level everything except for maths, guys. At the start of sixth year, I dropped down from higher level maths to ordinary level maths. And it was one of the best decisions of my life, guys. Such a weight lifted off my shoulders. So yeah, I was like barely passing higher level maths. And then once I got to ordinary, I was getting up to like 70, 80, sometimes even 90%. So yeah, if you were in the same boat as me, just barely passing higher level, I'd definitely recommend it. By the way guys, as I have you all here now, please don't forget to subscribe, click that subscribe button down below and don't forget to join my Discord server where you keep up to date with all my streams and videos and stuff that I'll be doing. So yeah, this is my, um, just my main pencil case. Um, you need a clear pencil case with the leaving search because if you bring in like um, a covered up one then the superintendent could think that you're trying to cheat. You can clearly see that I just have my pen and a couple of pencils in there. And guys, since I'm a type 1 diabetic as well, I also bring in my diabetic kit with me. This isn't really the typical kit, you see. I, it just has a lot of stuff inside it. just Because uh, anything can happen with it and anything can happen during exams. So yeah, that's what I bring into my um, exams with me every day, guys. And then, of course, on days with maths and stuff, I bring in my maths tin with compass and protractor and stuff inside. And I also just bring in this uh, trustworthy calculator as well. Look, it even has a smiley face on it. And it says yo. <laughs> Camera focus. Okay, there we go. It says yo on it. Wow, awesome. But that's all from me for today, guys. So I will see you ahead of Irish Paper 2 tomorrow morning. So yeah, everyone. Uh, Irish Paper 2 is over. I am actually extremely happy with what came up in it. So yeah. 
all good guys i'm actually just back from applying for my driver's permit so yeah i could be i could be driving in a few months time you know imagine a car vlog that, that, that'd be pretty cool i don't think i showed you guys but i have a mario wallet look how cool that is whoa but yeah history tomorrow it's my third last exam bring it on hello everyone so it is now the next morning um i have history now in about three hours and i have a bit of a head cold you can probably see it a bit in my eyes and that i've been sneezing all morning i have a red nose like freaking rudolph but yeah i'm gonna have a cup of tea now and take some uh antihistamine and hopefully i'll be better before the exam yeah but um i'm feeling very confident for history history and politics are my two favorite subjects so all should be okay hello molly how are you doing today so guys all that's left this week is history today wednesday the 15th of june it's at 2 p.m as you can see it is well you can't see that because the microwave is on the timer as you can see it's about five to one so we do have about one hour um or so left until history and then on friday we have german which is 9 30 to 12 and the listening is from 12 10 to 12 50 then we don't have anything until the 28th for politics so yeah all good guys it's time to go get my uniform and get ready for some history and by the way guys my sniffles are getting a bit better so yeah this like inhaler like nasal stick thing is helping me a lot Yeah. Also, guys, no Nintendo Direct announcement yesterday. Come on, man. Come on, dog. Where's the Nintendo Direct announcement? <laughs> I can't believe I just used like a what, like a four or five year old meme in my video. But yeah, guys, um, I. I actually have a very big cold now. Thankfully, the history exam went perfectly fine. But I came out and I just have a sore throat and everything. And it's just... <laughs> I just have a big cold. Thank God I am off tomorrow. There's no exam tomorrow, guys. So that's um that's at least something. I am going to rest and I need to sneeze again. <laughs> but I didn't. It's okay. I'm going to rest. I'm going to have a cup of tea. And I'm going to rest up for Friday's German examination. And then, as promised, guys, I'm going to talk about the exams that I have done so far. So, I'll see you then. Hey everyone, Big Blue from the future here. So, after my exams that week, nothing much exciting happened. I just got sicker due to my head cold and it was exacerbated by hay fever. And as you can see, the weather was pretty awful at most times as well. However, some exciting things did happen. I did go farming, if that counts as exciting. Look at the horses. Hey, that's me. But yeah, that was basically my week after that week of examinations. And then it was my birthday. Hello everyone, I am now 19 years old and that's actually kind of scary. Yeah guys, I had such a wonderful, wonderful birthday. I went for my first driving lesson yesterday 
Um, if you remember, earlier in the vlog I talked about applying for my learner's permit. Well, my permit came and my parents surprised me with my first driving lesson yesterday, guys. It actually went really well. I was very happy with it. I'll be out on those roads in no time. But guys, as you know, I'm doing the leave and such and I'm starting college in just a few months. Hopefully, all going well, fingers crossed. And I got a very practical present for college. Let me show you. So guys, let me show you. I got this wonderful backpack for college. It's gonna be so cool. I used to have like a big, like, like big, huge school bag and it was like very old and everything. Can you even see my face? I'm gonna like move my chair out of it. Yeah, the bag I had was like very old and stuff. It's back there in the trash somewhere. But um, this bag is actually really good. It's just gonna be for books and stuff. And it's not just gonna be for books because there is something else inside my bag, guys. That's gonna be also extremely, extremely good for college, which I'm super, super happy about. It's this. It is a laptop that I am going to be using for college, guys. And just look at that. It's nice and nice and blue. Look at that. Wow. It's gonna be so, so handy. I was so, so happy about this, guys. It's absolutely amazing. I'm going to be able to use it for like college essays and stuff as well. So I am super, super happy about that. Um, let me bring the camera around and show you what it's like, actually. Just look at those sleek, sleek buttons. Absolutely amazing, guys. I love it so, so much. And the best part is it is touchscreen as well. Look at that. It's touchscreen. How awesome is that, guys? That's going to be awesome for college. So yeah, guys, as you can tell, I am a very happy man right now. Later on, as I said, I am going to sit down at the computer and show you exactly what I was doing in my exams that I've had over the past month. And tomorrow I have my last exam, which is politics. And then hopefully I'll get the video up for you guys tomorrow, which is the 28th of June. So, there goes my chair. So yeah, guys, I am a very happy man. And did you see my birthday cake? My mum made this wonderful, wonderful birthday cake, guys. I absolutely love hot chocolate. It's, uh, like, it's just amazing. The detail that went into it is supposed to be like a giant hot chocolate cup. It's just absolutely amazing. I loved it so much. So yeah, thanks, mum. So yeah, guys, I'm going to go study for a while. I have my last Leaving Cert exam tomorrow and it's politics. I'm going to go study for a while. Then, as I said, I'm going to sit down at the computer and I'm going to go over exactly what exams I've had. And guys, there's rumours of a Nintendo Direct tomorrow. There's rumours of a Direct earlier in the month. I said so myself. Come on, Nintendo. Give us a Direct. So everyone, I just designed the thumbnail for this video. I think it looks really cool. I'm kind of like stressed out about the leave and search. Got my like exam paper there to the left. Speaking of exam papers, I'm gonna go up now and show you exactly what exams I faced earlier this month. Come on, let's go. Actually, no, screw that, I'm hungry. hungry and that's good. Anyway guys I decided to actually um, show you the exam that I've done tomorrow after my politics exam so I can actually include politics. So yeah I'll do that tomorrow after my politics exam but guys the weather's awful. Look at how dark it's gotten and so early as well. It's just <laughs> absolute raining all the time. It's normally great weather during the leave and sud but just look it's absolutely terrible weather. Well, yeah, guys, I have all my study done for my politics. So um, tomorrow morning, going to do a politics exam. Then I'm done my leaving cert. I'll go over the exams I have. And hopefully, if rendering takes fast enough and stuff, I'll have the video uploaded for you tomorrow evening. I'm going to go have a cup of tea, have some of my birthday cake in that fridge, in that room. And I'll see you guys in the morning, my last exam. See you then. And by the way, guys, I have started editing this very video that you're watching now, so I'm not going to, like, cram, like, all the editing tomorrow. Got to make sure that quality is good for you guys, you know? Time for politics. everyone so yeah i'm going into politics now it's my last time in my school uniform i just realized so yeah kind of weird but 
going in for politics now and I'll talk to you afterwards. Tuesday, June 28th, and I'm done my politics exam, guys. It went so well, so I'm so, so happy. I began to record <laughs> just behind me at my computer, my, um, my kind of, um, all my exams that I did, that I said I was going to do for you guys. But then I was like, it's actually kind of boring. Like, all I was saying was like, oh yeah, that question came up. Yeah, that was a nice question, just like 10 times over. So I decided to just stop, but um, the politics went really, really well. So I'm very, very happy about that. And tonight, actually, I'm going to start a new adventure for this YouTube channel. I'm going to record the first episode of a podcast, of a new Nintendo podcast that I'm doing. And I have a very special guest organised as well for this very first inaugural podcast episode. So I'm super, super hyped about that, guys. But for now, for this vlog, I think that's kind of it. My leaving cert is out of the way. Um, I might show you just a small bit of a few exam papers that I did, so um, let's go to my computer and just see a small bit instead of bringing you through every single exam. Hello everyone, I'm now at my PC in my um, Streamlabs thing, so my webcam is up here. And I'm just going to show you a couple of the exams that I went through. This is the official website for the State Examinations Commission, of course. We're going to agree to those terms and conditions. We're going to see the 2022 papers for the Leaving Certificate. And um, is politics even up yet? God damn it, politics isn't even up yet. It's like, it's like half three. <laughs> but um, I'm going to go into what I did first. So English. So like this is basically it. Um, I'm not going to go through every single exam because I tried that. So yeah, this is kind of like the start of each exam. The first page of it. State Examinations Commission Leaving Certificate Exam 2022. English Higher Level. So this was on Wednesday the 8th of June that you saw earlier on in the vlog. Morning, 9.30 to 12.20. So we had to like read these. We needed to choose one question out of the three texts to do. And so I chose... Um, I forget what I chose. Uh, was it something in this one? I think I chose a question B. I chose this one and it was very coincidental as well. It says write the text for the podcast and I'm going to record a podcast tonight hopefully. So yeah. And then we had to choose an essay to do. So I chose question two from here. I was a candidate for the presidency of Ireland. So yeah, that was a great one. Another exam I was interested in was history. I absolutely love history so much. History and politics are my two favourite subjects, guys. I'm hoping to become a secondary school teacher in them one day. The case study for this one, for this year's one, was the Coleraine University controversy. It could have been one of three topics from politics and society in Northern Ireland. Um, it could have been the Apprentice Boys in Derry, the Coleraine University Crisis, or the Sunningdale Agreement. Of course, you won't understand a lot of those unless you're actually doing the Leaving Cert. But I was happy with the case study that came up. And then we had to choose two essays from these two sections. So um, any of these, we had to choose two from all of these. I chose this one. How effectively did US leaders deal with problems posed by two of the following? Korea, Cuba, Vietnam. I discussed all three to give me the maximum potential. Um, for this and I also did number three here. What were the characteristics of Joseph Stalin's leadership? So yeah, th those are very handy questions not gonna lie Very handy indeed. I also did geography up there. Where's geography there? Yeah, I did mathematics as well I don't think you guys would be very interested in that. I did some German as well Um, You can listen to the sound file if you want and so yeah, this is what I had to listen to for my listening exam Commission this grew the start State, State Examinations, Examinations Commission. Screwdu Naharcha Vila Fihado. Leaving Certificate Examination 2022. Okay, you get the idea to do some German. Gar nicht. Yeah, that's German. Ich bekomme schlechte Noten. But yeah, um, that was very good. Um, the listening exam in German was actually wonderful. So yeah, um, I think that's it. I wish I could show you the politics exam, but it doesn't seem to be up yet. So yeah, sorry about that. So yeah, everyone, 
This was the month of June in the life of Big Blue. It was a kind of crazy month, but in the end, I think it worked out okay. We had the leaving cert, we had my birthday, and we had loads of other stuff as well that you saw in this vlog. So guys, I put a lot of time into this vlog. If you enjoyed, then please do click that subscribe button down below. It only takes a second. And do not forget to join my Discord server down in the description below as well. But for now, guys, I'm gonna go get to work editing. I'm not gonna get this out on June 28th because I actually wanna spend time perfecting this edit for you guys. So it is gonna be, um, it's probably gonna be tomorrow, June 29th. So I'll see you guys later. Thanks so much for watching and goodbye. Oh,